What's up, everyone? It's me, Kiki Solana, welcoming you to BYUSN right now. I am at a very rainy Lavelle Edwards Stadium where BYU football is taking on number 14, Boise State, in our homecoming game. I show you some of the homecoming festivities that were happening on campus yesterday, but there's going to be even more tonight. We'll have to check it out. A lot of unknowns going into this game due to injury. What we do know now is Boise State has both Hank Bachmeyer and Chase Cord warming up at the quarterback position, so we'll see which one starts for them. We do know what quarterback is starting for BYU. It will be Baylor Romney, although Jaron Hall was warming up as well. A couple other notable players that were warming up that we were unsure of is Diane Gonwolaku, Troy Warner, but Tristan Hodge not warming up with the team, not dressed out, obviously still injured. Every home football game, they light the Y on the field. But for homecoming week, we light it on the mountain. It'll be Skyler Southam kicking off for the Cougars to John Hightower. Keen on this opening drive. Romney to Katoa, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown. Isaiah Kafusi comes in clutch with an interception. Let's go. Someone we haven't seen this game is running back, Emmanuel is super. So we're seeing Sione Fee now instead. Machine yard so far tonight for Boise State. Here's Cord. It's batted down incomplete. Fourth down. It's halftime. Boise State leads 10 to 7. I'm hoping the boys bring the heat in the second half. But for now, I need to find some heat of my own. So I came up to the countdown to kickoff set to hopefully get warm. But if anything, it's colder up here. It's okay though. I know where to go. I know where to go. Yeah! The Rock oh is the best place to stay warm. Rain or shine, baby. The Rock helped a lot. But BYU TV treats us right, okay? We have space heaters here. So um, if anyone needs me, I'll be here all halftime. Over last week, six sacks allowed in that game against USF. Here's Fee now, big run. Nobody in his way. Touchdown, Sione Fina. The rain has officially turned to snow, but it's okay because we are all feeling great as Cougar fans right now. BYU scores again, making the score 21 to 10. The mayor here in Provo. That's intercepted by BYU. Second interception. This is wild. It might be freezing out here, but the team is on fire and the entire stadium can feel it too. Our Cougs are pulling out all the stops. Here's Katoa to Hefo, Flea Ficker, Romney, another man wide open, and it's another. Touchdown for Matt Bushman. This is really happening, you guys. We have hit turbulence here in LES. And while we have a second, I just want to take a moment to say how great it feels to have Diane Gonwolaku back. He has five tackles so far, including a tackle for loss and a sack. We've got a whole nother quarter with him and the rest of the team. Let's turn this thing up. One for one tonight on fourth down with a touchdown. This one looks like they got it. Still moving the pile. Clock winds down and BYU wins it 28 to 25. What a game. I gotta go celebrate. One second. Kiki, Kiki, we have to finish the episode. 